welcome back to my channel. If this is your first time here, I'm Hannes from Vaik and I film mostly videos like this. I go and film where I am and also what I do. I sometimes do vlogs, sometimes I show you an event that I do and for instance the Springboks versus Argentina or South Africa versus Ar 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 Argentina game that I videoed. Uh, most of you have seen me make that. Well, that was a fun video. And if you can't hear me right now, it's because I'm on top of this copy or a small mountain and the wind is really blowing. So I think turn up your volume and I'll try to edit this as good as possible with the sound. And for now, I'll bring my camera just closer to my, to my mouth so that you can hear me. Okay, today's video is about the work that I do. Uh, people ask me, well, what do you do for a living? You can't just be living off YouTube. Uh, that's true. And what I do is I'm a video editor for someone uh, in White River. And um, I enjoy that work a lot and I just took a break from work right now I, it's still I'm still on, on the clock actually and um, I just came to film this video quickly here on the mountain um, I edit videos for the guy and um, I enjoy that work a lot so it's from very short videos like shorts reels up to long videos like hour video hour and a half videos that uh, he then uses on his channel and um, yeah that's that's how I make my money uh, mainly and then also do shoots for clients on my, on my personal side and um, yeah this channel is for you and me to get to know Nell Sprite, get to know the film industry. Um, I also want to teach you some stuff here. Uh, go and look at uh, other videos I've made already um, re regarding uh, video on cell phones, um, like the video now. I'm shooting on my iPhone 13, and um, yeah, I'm also using this small tripod it's about um, 30 to 40 centimeters long in the total length when it's pulled out fully and um, yeah that's what I use sometimes I use a gimbal for my cell phone and then for big commercial work I use the cell phone plus my um, not my normal camera um, and then I also want to talk to you about a second thing that I was talking that I was actually thinking about and that was why I switched over from my um, normal camera as in a Canon 77D to my cell phone as my main camera now the reason why I switched over to my cell phone is because it shoots in 4k and it shoots in 60 frames a second now I know there's cell phones well iPhones out there that can shoot 4k in 120 frames a second well I don't need it but the main reason why I've got my iPhone as my main camera is because it shoots in such a good quality yes I need to have a very good quality sound but for these type of videos the the vlogs um, it's all I need I need a cell phone and right now it shoots good enough and it has a, a mic on the back of the cell phone and that's how I shoot my videos I don't see what the shot is right now like so if I'm in, in frame I'm in frame if I'm out of the frame I'm out of the frame 
Um, as long as you, the viewer, can follow along, that is good enough. When I do big commercial stuff, I'll be facing the screen and look at what I'm shooting, but then obviously I'm shooting something else and not facing the screen. So, for videos like this, I shoot it like this. I can also do a shot like this where you're going to lose my sound now. It's going to be like this. Yes, I faked losing sound there. And also, I can hit the camera down, get nice stable shots like the ones you've seen now where I shot the grass and I shot some of the shrubs here and the tree or myself walking to this rock over here um, I can get nice stable shots with this thing I think this tripod cost me like 120 or 150 rand and I bought it about two years ago in Pretoria I'm staying in Nelspreet if you didn't know that that's the Pretoria city is about 330-340 kilometers away from Nelspreet and um, that's why where I used to stay uh, that's also where I studied film and uh, in my next video I'll talk to you about um, my expectations that I had when I finished film school versus the reality of my life after film school and I think that would be a very interesting video for you to watch and I think a lot of you who are aspiring filmmakers would benefit from that a lot so stay tuned for that video and uh, sorry again for the sound that's so bad with the wind but uh, I needed to get out and experience this view this view is just incredible I can see almost all of now spread from here um, I can see about 50 kilometers um, in that type direction um, you may have seen that video um, earlier but uh, yeah I can basically see White River from from this side that's how far I can see um, on a clear day you can see very far and um, later this year in December and also November that's coming up I might upload a nice video of me on uh, this excursion that I'll, I'll be on and uh, I look forward to it so stay tuned for that as well and also end of this year like through the end 31st till the 2nd of January I'll be in the Kruger National Park with the family and I'm also gonna film that so that's also gonna come up and please keep me accountable please ask me keep asking me when is the time when is it coming when is it coming keep keep reminding me and again if you haven't subscribed to my channel please do so and um, go check out my other videos that I've made and leave a comment on this video give a like Maybe some suggestions of other content um, that you can suggest but go read my bio of this channel see what a channel is about and yeah maybe you'll learn something uh, from old videos and I appreciate you and thank you for sticking by up to now and tomorrow I'm gonna make another video but I'm keeping that as a surprise so stay tuned